There is a COVID lockdown tonight at 34 Illinois prisons. No visits by family members, although COVID infections are soaring tonight at some Department of Correction facilities. The I-team has learned that at one state prison here, more than 40% of the inmate population is COVID positive right now. He said, Mom, I'm very sick. Very, very sick. Mary Thompson in the hospital herself tonight is more worried about her son, who is here at Western Illinois Correctional Center in Mount Sterling. Thompson's son among 600 inmates here currently infected by COVID-19. That's almost 41% of this jailhouse, and another 35 staff members are also sick. Thompson's son, Robert Green, has been in prison nearly 26 years for a Cook County murder and armed robbery. 54-year-old Green was recently given a towel and two squirts of disinfectant to sanitize his entire cell, according to his mother. But she says it wasn't enough, and the 54-year-old inmate now has COVID. They need to be able to sanitize their space. And whether they're inmates or not, they need to be treated like human beings. Western tonight, a close second to state leading Menard Correctional Center with 605 prisoners infected. That is more than a third of the entire inmate population at maximum security Menard south of St. Louis. And 84 staff members are also sick at Menard right now. Pontiac has 129 staff COVID infected and 374 sick inmates. Inmate mother Mary Thompson says her greatest fear is that COVID will result in a death sentence for her son, who has a 2037 parole date, but is fighting for an earlier release. If they don't do better about getting him some medication and sanitizing the facility, I might lose my child. That's my only child. She says her son has asthma and is particularly vulnerable to serious COVID complications. Today, we repeatedly asked the Illinois Department of Corrections about these expanding COVID numbers. The IDOC did not respond. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.